Hey guys, and in today's video of what I have to review is my Spirit Halloween 2018 model of Double Trouble. So let's get straight into it. So what we have here is Double Trouble. These animatronics were, were sold back in 2018 and 2019. However, this specific model is the 2018 model. Uh, they were sold for around $179.99 their first year, and then when they returned, they returned with a $10 increase in stores. Their next year, which was 2019, um, which I get it. They figured, you know, two animatronics, two life sizes into one and stuff, so they figured that price point. Um, I think she they definitely they should have been a bit cheaper as I would say because their quality Isn't the best like for what you're getting like they're literally using a Christmas tree type of base Literally to keep them Held up they could have done something different there But however that was back then if this if this was them now maybe they could do a better job a better base and stuff which is definitely possible they could do just a long base and yeah perfectly fine instead of instead of using christmas tree type of stands but other than that these girls were actually in the beginning people liked them a lot because they represent the movie the shining in a way like the grady twins from the movie that's what these girls represented. Two twin girls, they're holding hands like that. Um, same height, everything. And the way how they were speaking, talking. Sim it, it was like a similar um, a similar thing to like the Shining movie and stuff. And I really like this type of idea of an uh, animatronic. Something we really didn't see it back then at the time. They did, they did make about two more of these twins, not Spare Halloween, but Morbid Enterprises. They did like two more of like their versions of their twins, which weren't really the best. I personally like these way better. The looks alone are pretty creepy and so on. Details, they really don't have much besides their dress. Their dresses are, you know, they have a lot of um, designs, you know, going on with like flowers, I believe. Their face, not so much. I mean, some shadings of purple or something. And uh, you can also tell the difference between the 2018 and 2019. This is 2018, which is the face. The faces on the 2018 models were definitely way better. The, what, the faces in the, in the 2019 models were terrible. I hated them. They looked, they just looked terrible. Like they looked so off. Even the head shapes on those, like a few of them, they were deformed looking. They just look weird. Like they literally did not look like twins. These these guys, these girls look like twins when they were first released. So like whatever they did by changing the face mold or something, it wasn't a, it wasn't a good idea. But um yeah. Setup wise, very simple, straightforward. Usually you need like two people to set them up. However, I set them up by myself. Um, very simple. Christmas tree type of base. You connect the legs, the poles, the body, and then the heads, you just put them in, that's it. Um, animation, so what they do is they just both simply turn their heads and that's it. And then they, they have about two different phrases and that's pretty much it. They have a volume control in the back. And I have them hooked up to a try me button to make my life easier and I'll have to be going in front of them, waving in front of them and stuff. So I could just activate them from a try me button. But um, yeah, I've I, I almost forgot. How did I get these, how did I get them? So a little bit of a story. So I really wanted them at the time at Spirit, but I never got a chance to buy them. So I believe it was around December of 2019 or 2020 around there. And I was, in the middle of my trip and I saw that these girls were posted up on eBay for like $240 and the seller said they were working so I was like perfect let me use my Christmas money I bought them I ordered them and they came to my house I plug them in and they did not do nothing so I was like oh shoot so it turns out they were fried out 
So at the time, Spirit Halloween, I had messaged them and yeah, things were different back then. But um, they had sent me a replacement module for the one that, uh, control box, the one that um, where you plug in the adapter, batteries, this and that. So once they sent me that replacement, I took off the bad module control box and I put in the new one and voila, she she's fully working. They're both fully working. Time, there's been a few times where one of their heads will stop moving, but but then when I reactivate them and stuff, it starts moving again. I really don't know why they do that. They did that back then. They did that just a few minutes ago when I was recording them in another video, but um, no big deal. They still work 100% fully. I love them a lot. They remind me of the Shining. That's why I really wanted them. They're both creepy. They tend to scare people here and there. But um, yeah, I think now it's time for me to demo them so you guys can see them in action. The syndrome has raised our mother's head. Can you help us find it? <laughs> Daddy said we have to play outside. He doesn't want any more blood on the floor. <laughs> you see, so that one stops. That one keeps on moving. That's weird. Let me activate it one more time. Summer is hot. Winter is cold. But we don't feel a thing. And we'll never get old. So yeah, that pretty much does it for this video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more coming up shortly.